Hi, welcome to the garden. It's a bit too windy for the mic, so I'll do a voiceover later. And hopefully I can get things done before those clouds set in. I'm using up more scrap that's been lying around, so I've got some bits of pallets, I've got some old floorboards, I've got a galvanised steel tray, which will make the bottom of it. Let's just do a bit of marking up, and we're going to cut this down into some slats. April, what did you expect? Rough sanding these boards will allow the preservative to go in easier. And notice how useful the vertical planing support is. There's no complex joinery for this project. Just miter all the slats and everything's just going to get packed together and screwed together. Now I'll just make up two ends and two sides. And screw them together with some corner blocks. Hardwood feet both inside the tray and on the outside. Now during the video you may have seen me using this and I've been driving some screws. It's a magnet driver, it's by Microton. Basically you have your screwdriver bit, hex bit, a little sleeve that goes on top of it, screw fits on, magnet holds it upside down, you know, anywhere you want to go. The other thing that's in here which I really like is a little fork which will take nails and little pins so you can get your pin up close to work without getting your fingers anywhere near the hammer. And uh, Microton, I've been good enough to support Toolmake 18 by giving away a set of these. So if you get involved in Toolmake 18, you could possibly win a set. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share the video. It means a lot to me. All the wood in this project was recycled. Information about Toolmake 18 can be found at www.womadod.com and on the Toolmake 18 Facebook page.